So let's begin with our circuit. The circuit consists of LEDs and resistors which are connected in series to each other. The resistors have a value of 220 ohms and are going to be used to limit the current across the LEDs. They are connected to the negative terminal of the breadboard and to the cathodes of the LEDs. The anodes of the LEDs are going to be connected to the output pins of the board. I'm choosing the output pins from 13 to 9. And I'm going to connect them to the LEDs via these jumper wires. Before we connect the output pins, we have to connect the ground terminal of the breadboard to ground pin of the board. I'm using black jumper wire and now we can connect the rest of the jumper wires so I've connected the pin 13 now pin 12 for white LED pin 11 for red pin 10 for, for yellow LED and the last one is going to be pin 9 which is for green LED I'm going to connect my Arduino Uno board by this cable to my computer. But before that, I'm going to write the code which is suitable for this experiment. And I'm going to upload the code and we are going to see the result together. So here is the code which I have written for this project. I have chosen the Arduino Uno board and I have defined five variables LED1 to LED5 and I have assigned them a value starting from 13 to 9 these values are gonna represent my output pins or the Arduino board next on the void setup portion of the code I have told the Arduino that these LEDs are going to be my output using pin mode function on the loop portion of the code, which we have to write our main code and runs over and over again, I have written five digital write functions so that the LED is going to be turned on. And after that, I have written five digital write functions so that the LED is going to be turned off. And the LEDs are going to be turned on and off one at a time with a specific delay when the LEDs are active high or on they are going to stay on for 200 milliseconds and when they are off they are going to stay off for 400 milliseconds we are good to go let's upload the code and let's have a look at the breadboard the board is connected to the laptop via this cable and I have uploaded the code on the Arduino platform and as you can see the result is perfect we have made our LED sequential circuit the LEDs are going to be turned on and off one at a time they are gonna stay on for 200 milliseconds and they are gonna stay off for 400 milliseconds if you find this video interesting and you enjoyed the video, please like it and do not forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks and have a good day.